All right, Alfred Telefero, Mr. Telefero TV. I want to make this clear, all right? I want to make this clear. What I'm about to say is a perfect teaching mechanism, all right? What I'm about to say is that this is a good teaching time. Here's the reality of the situation. Kendrick Perkins said there's no beef between Russell Westbrook and Kevin Durant anymore. As a matter of fact, they're back on talking terms. Remember, Kendrick Perkins was a, a big part of that Oklahoma City team a couple years back that were trying to compete for championships. They're back on talking terms. Ke uh, Kevin Durant and Russell Westbrook now communicate. I'm being told that it happened All-Star Weekend when the two rekindled their little flame. After the infamous alley-oop, apparently after that, the two have been communicating since then. Make something clear to you this has nothing to do with kevin durant this has everything to do with russell westbrook russell westbrook is the only one feeling some type of way kevin durant doesn't care if you ask him about russell westbrook he'll tell you yeah he's a great guy just decided to make a decision that's best for my family i love that this and that that he's a great guy I took up for him this and that but durant your actions speak everything the opposite you keep saying he's a great guy, he's a great teammate. You didn't like playing with him. If you liked playing with him, you wouldn't go to the team that beat you after you had a 3-1 series lead in the Western Conference Finals last year. You wouldn't go to that team. The team that, that many has deemed to be the, the, the franchise of the decade. You wouldn't go to that team if you really loved playing with this other guy. You wouldn't go to that team. Durant, you didn't like playing with Russell Westbrook. Stop fabricating and stop sugarcoating, but you have nothing to be ashamed of. This is all about Russell Westbrook. Russ is the one feeling some type of way about Durant leaving. Russ is the one that got commercials with Lil Uzi Vert's song in the background. Now I do what I want. Yeah, now I do what I want. You know what that means. He like Durant left town, so now he get to do what the hell he want. And that's why he averaged a triple-double, because he's able to do what the hell he want. But while averaging a triple-double, Russell Westbrook's ass is on the couch right now. Or maybe he's doing some fashion. Shout out to Russell Westbrook. He really owns it in the fashion world right now. He's doing whatever you want to do. I don't rock with the clothes that he wear, but I can't do nothing but support the hustle. This had nothing to do with Kevin Durant ever. This all had to do with Russell Westbrook feeling some type of way. And the fact that Kendrick Perkins says they're communicating. I mean, Kendrick Perkins was pretty plugged in. He was an influential part. In that Oklahoma City team, maybe not by the stats, but he had a big presence on that team. He was a championship leadership. All right. But this has everything to do with Russell Westbrook getting over it and just realizing at the end of the day, Kevin Durant didn't want to play with you. And there's a notion out there that, that Kevin Durant might go back to Oklahoma City. If he did, it would be in spite of Russell Westbrook. This wouldn't have anything to do with Russell Westbrook. This will have everything to do with Kevin Durant. Just if he wins a championship, maybe it'll be like, damn, I did everything I need to do. I'm a champion now. Let me go back to Oklahoma City. I doubt that be the case. This wouldn't do anything, have anything to do with Russell Westbrook. It'll be about the fans of Oklahoma City. He didn't like playing basketball with him. And if you're watching the Golden State Warriors play basketball right now, Kevin Durant is getting his average, where he pretty much has been averaging his entire career. On less shots, he's still taking less attempts than Klay Thompson and Steph Curry on the team. He's getting less shots. But he's just as productive, just as even more efficient. So the game of basketball has become easier, and he's still getting the points that he averaged, and he's getting more rebounds, and he's more efficient on the def defensive side of the court. What's the problem? Because a couple media members and a couple fans think you you ruined the game of basketball. Hell, I think it. But that man has every right to do whatever the hell he wants that makes his life easier. And that's where we are with it. He ain't going back to no damn Oklahoma City Thunder. And the fact that they're talking, it has nothing to do with Kevin Durant. It speaks all about Russell Westbrook just getting over the fact that Kevin Durant did not want to play with him. If you're looking to book me for an interview video or by phone, if you're looking to have your music or your skill featured on my daily podcast, if you're looking to book me for a speaking engagement to help motivate some kids, if you're looking to have me rock some of your clothing to help promote your brand, make sure you hit me up at bookingatismistelefero.com. Again, that's booking. That is 